When it comes to continuing traditions, a family in the small town of Peguche, Ecuador, opens their door for tourists to come and experience the art of music. They offer demonstrations in instrument making, indigenous dance, and the opportunity for visitors to play and buy the handcrafted instruments. Being able to see the art and technique of wood carving allows one to understand and appreciate the beauty of indigenous wood instruments. With the precise carvings and the delicate weavings of the woodwinds, the beautiful sounds from the past come alive for the tourists to experience. The grand finale of the visit is a full family band routine performed for listeners. Being at 13,000 elevation in the mountains, it was out of this world. It felt like we were in a, on a different planet. Like the plants were nothing like you've ever seen in your life. Everything was so foreign. <laughs> Everything was very, very muted in color. I thought it was perfectly tranquil. It wasn't vibrant. Nothing was intrusive. Everything was just very gray and wonderful. I loved it. That was beautiful. We're hiking, and then all of a sudden we enter like what I would consider um, a magical forest. <laughs> um, it was absolutely out of this world. We're just talking like branches everywhere, just everything was twisted, and um, but it was just like, yeah, unreal. Just like you stepped into a fairy tale. I mean, you're seeing so many wonderful things, but then when you get it explained to yourself, it's gained so much depth, it's much more rich. Being that Ecuador is such a environmentally diverse place, we've seen a, such a vast arrangement of uh, different locations from the beach, the mountains, to the rainforest. It was definitely somewhere in between the little log rafts and the cable crossing the river. It was something to document in photos. Saraguro was amazing in the sense that it's unlike any other place we visited in Ecuador. I feel like they've reached that median where they have like incorporated some of the new and the modern and at the same time like held on to what's important about their history and their heritage. In todas las en todas las casas, lo que es una delante de una casa. Entonces eso es con la finalidad de que no comprar, no salir al mercado. Today is Sunday, which is the weekly market day here in Saraguro. 
people from all over the area come in to buy and trade their produce for the week. The landscape to me is one of my favorite parts. You have this center, this this city, this Pueblo that's existing, and then as you go out, it just expands out into the mountains. All around you, you have these, this incredible view of just being surrounded. We went to uh, a really awesome shaman cleansing ritual, and it is just blows your mind how much they respect and how much they acknowledge the blessings they have in nature, in mother nature, in just the fruitfulness and abundance that they have around them. The semester in the Andes can be an eye-opening experience that reveals just how diverse this world is. You are forced out of your box in order to widen your horizons. When this happens, you realize learning about the world is a lifelong adventure.